What's good, YouTube? This your boy, DJ Q Waves. Back again with another new video. If you're new to the channel, be sure to hit that red subscribe button and that notification bell as well. If you want to find me on social media pages, that'll be in the link in the description. If you're an old subscriber, welcome back. New subscriber, welcome to the channel. All right, so the new partnership deal between Jay-Z and Rock Nation and the NFL has got a lot of people opinion about Hove not involving Colin Kaepernick in the partnership. So Jay held a joint press conference with NFL Commissioner Roger Goodell to officially announce the partnership. Now I'm gonna play the clip of the uh, whole presser press about what Jay Z had to say about the Colin Kaepernick and other issues. Check this clip out. Now I think you said you're asking Jay. You asking me? <laughs> Commissioner, go ahead. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Definitely not the commissioner yet. Can you hear what you're saying? Okay. I think we've passed kneeling. Yeah, I think it's time to go into uh, actionable items. I think everyone knows what the issue is. <laughs> and we're, we're done with that. We, 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 everyone knows what the we. You know what the issue is? You know why we were kneeling? Okay. Do you know the issue? Yeah. yeah. Do you know the issue? <laughs> yes. We all know the issue now. Okay. Next. What are we moving on next? And I'm not again. So to be clear, for the room, I'm not minimizing that part of it because that has to happen. That's a necessary part of the process. But now we all know what's going on. What are we going to do? How are we going to stop? Because the kneeling was not about a job. It was about injustice. Let me bring attention to injustice. Everyone's saying, how are you going forward if Cap doesn't have a job? This wasn't about him having a job. Mm. Right? That became part of it. That became part of the discussion. He was kneeling um, to bring attention to injustice. We know what it is. Now, how do we address that injustice? And to go to Jay's point, uh, we listened to our players. We understood what our players were saying, and we created a platform of which to help drive change in communities that Colin has raised and that other players have raised. And this, is, this, this partnership, in addition to the entertainment aspect and bringing football and music together, is going to help us make even greater change. And, and we call it protest of progress, right? We need to make progress as community. Now, after hearing that, you know, Jay-Z told reports that, you know, I think we forgot that Colin's thing, whole thing was to bring attention to social injustice. So in that case, this is success. This is the next thing. If protest on the field is the most effective way, then protest on the field. But if you have a vehicle that can inspire change or you can speak to the masses, educate at the same time as well, tell people what's going on so people are not controlling your narrative. Not telling you your protest is about this. I think we passed kneeling. I think it's time to go into, into our accountable items. Now, a lot of people have a lot of different opinions about whole Jay-Z's whole, you know, taking on this, like, oh, he's trying to, like, they trying to use Jay-Z's to cover up the whole Colin Kaepernick thing, and, like, you know, like, Colin Kaepernick still doesn't have a job, like, what's going on, they trying to, like, you know, the NFL's blackballing, trying to cover up the blackballing of Colin Kaepernick, you know what I'm saying, but... Jay-Z was just doing this for money and for his business. He don't really care about Colin and stuff, but I, I, I don't know. My opinion on this, like, I don't think Jay-Z's going to do what Jay-Z's going to do. You know what I'm saying? It's not his fault. He has no control of that, but he did say that Colin would like to, you know, be involved. He can be involved, but like they said, like, they passed the whole kneeling thing. Like, a lot of people kind of try to say Jay-Z's a sellout. Yeah, I would never call Jay-Z a sellout for what he's doing, man. He's doing right for him and his business. But I don't know. People still watch the info regardless. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I, like people are hypocrites. I don't want to hear this Jay-Z, this, and that. Just like how, you know, I don't watch the NFL no more because Colin Kaepernick don't get a job. You have people that was kneeling, like Eric Reed. He still kneels, and he has a job. So it's not like... You know what I'm saying? But I understand Colin Kaepernick was the face of the whole kneeling thing. So it's like they don't want no controversy. But they say they support Colin. But I don't know, man. I know a lot of teams need a quarterback. <laughs> the Redskins, that's one of them. But that's my opinion. And at the end of that, make sure you hit that like button, the subscribe button, and the notification bell. Peace.